Hello YouTube, this is Paper2031. For this video, I'm showing you a bobblehead, which is of Mark Burley from the Toronto Blue Jays. Um, this bobblehead was given out on August 24th, 2014, and 20,000 of these uh, bobbleheads were given out. So I'll start off by showing you the packaging first. As you can see, you have a nice little clear window right there, so you can actually see the bobblehead that you're getting. So that's always nice to see. At the very bottom, it says Mark Burley. Then on the side, you have a picture of Mark Burley and some info, which I'll show you right now. So uh, you could just read this. Uh, you can just pause it and then just read this if you'd like, which is always nice to see. And then there's Burley. Then on the back, you have uh, Burley right there. And he's winding up for a great pitch. Um, and his autograph right there. Um, he's number 56, by the way. As you can see at the very top, it says number 56. And then on the other side of the side of the box, you can see um, just the final stuff that they were giving out that year as a, a stadium giveaway, which was which was a warm winter hat giveaway. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to go to that game and didn't get that. So, unfortunately, this winter my head. I uh, had to suffer through the cold. And then I'll show you the bottom. Um, currently, uh, the Blue Jays are using BDA um, uh, to make these bobbleheads, which I think um, they make the best bobbleheads, in my opinion. A lot of details and stuff. Um, this bobblehead was made in China in 2014. So now I'll just open up this bobblehead. See? So let's see, a uh, nice little tab right there. You can just remove that. He's encased in this plastic, which I love. There's nothing else inside. Yikes, shouldn't have done that. And yeah, so you just remove that. And then you have Burley right there. So I'll give you a nice little shot right here like that. So yeah, so there's Mark Burley. Um, I guess he has the uh, blue uh, uniform with white pants, a blue hat, which is nice. Um, at the very base, it says Toronto Blue Jays, so there wasn't a sponsor at the time for this, which I prefer. I don't like seeing those sponsors. And then at the very bottom, it says Mark Burley. Then the side. Really cool back and his back now <laughs> nice so now I'll just show you this bobblehead up close and I'll start off with the base once again at the very bottom you can see it says Mark Burley and um, although there's a little piece over here extra piece that you know wasn't cleaned off I'm not too concerned about that then at the top over here just above that you have the Toronto Blue Jays logo or font and then something I always love about these bobbleheads is that they put the brands that these uh, players use. So over here you can see you can clearly see the swoosh from Nike, and that's something I really like. Let's see at the bottom of his um, cleat, not too many details there. And his white pants from the uniform. You have two white stripes or blue stripes. So sorry, um, and those are really nicely done. Usually you get them all messed up like that. And then at the back, you can see his jersey. It says number 56, Burley. And then his glove, a black glove. And he has a little ball in there. Yeah, so they even went so far as to add the ball inside of his hand like that, which is nice. And he does have like a chain over here, which he does wear. Um, See? Yeah, see, I think it's like a dog chain because uh, he does like his pit bulls and unfortunately it's one of the reasons why uh, I guess he was a little sad when he moved to Toronto because he wasn't able to bring his pit bulls, but uh, I guess uh, he's making it work at, he, anyways, um, keeping them in Florida I believe or something like that. But yeah, so now the details on the face. Um, I don't know, I wouldn't say it looks like him 100%. I've seen better 
um, better looking uh, bobbleheads that look more like the player than this one. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think? But besides that, um, the quality of this base is really nice. I mean, you don't see no overrun, no uh, nothing like that. So it's pretty clean. I like this. Even the bottom of the hat, the brim, you can see it's nicely cleaned. The back. And just the logo of the Blue Jays right there. And uh, that's it for now. Um, actually, I need to make a bobble, right? There you go, the most important part. Just to make sure it bobbles. So yeah, that's it for this video. If you want to see pictures, um, just follow the links to my blog. And I'll see you guys next time.